Oh, hello. I've got a glove bagpipe here that I've been trying out. I thought I might show you how I did it as well. I've got some things here that we need to make our glove bagpipe. We've got a cardboard tube, some gloves, some straws, sellotape and some scissors. That's all you need to make your very own musical instrument. First things first, we get our cardboard tube, then we get one of our gloves that your parents might have lying around the house for their cleaning, then we place our glove over our cardboard tube. Next, we get some sellotape to secure our glove around our tube. So once I find the end, we want a nice big long strip of sellotape. Place this all the way around our tube. Now we want to make sure that the sellotape goes all the way around and there's no gaps for the air to escape. Very important. Then we want to get our glove uh, with our scissors and we want to make a little cut in one of the fingers of our glove. So get an adult to help you if you need to. Then, once we've made our little hole, we're going to put our straw into the glove, just a little way in. Then we need a little bit more sellotape just to secure everything. And place the sellotape around the straw and again, making sure there's no gaps for any of the air to escape because it's the air that's very important for this musical instrument. So, to play our glove bagpipe, we pull our glove over the end of our tube and hold it in place with our hand. Then we want to blow into the straw, so we inflate our glove. And once our glove is inflated, we can release our hand a little bit and this should cause some vibrations to occur at the top of our cardboard tube. These vibrations are gonna travel all the way down the tube and this is gonna make the sound. So let's give it a go, see if it works. There you go. That's how to make your very own musical glove bagpipe. Give it a go at home.